Hello there, this is Steve uh, Pudge AGS, aka Little London, and uh, this is a short video on how to change and check your uh, rear pads on a Medina Euro 4. Um, the first thing that I do obviously is take the side panel off and then I loosen these and when I've taken them off I always copper grease them and put them back in again just in case you need to get them out. I'll just use a copper grease. Um, you're going to need a 12mm spanner which is one there and one down there. I've taken that one out down there and there's this one here which is end tight. Like I said I'm doing this um, as a quick video really. In fact I've just, I've just checked all this because I'm doing a PDI on it and I always strip the brakes down anyway. So I like to cover the exhaust up um, because I'm going to try and lift the caliper up and out and then you can twist it over and then rest it on top there like so that's why I put the cover on the exhaust it doesn't wreck it okay then you're gonna need an allen key and you've got one and two um, I use a t-bar and basically you're gonna unscrew this out unscrew this out and then your pads which sit there they will locate in and I'm just going to grab myself a tool now put it on pause and then come back and then uh, show you exactly what I mean okay so I've, I've loosened off the retainers there and this is going to be quite difficult because you want to squeeze the pads in and as you squeeze the pads in you can then release these uh, these bolt these bolts one second see if I can do this okay and they literally just pull out and it looks like that long one now okay and then when you've pulled both of them out your pads will fall out um, and then it's a case of oh, it's gonna be very difficult to do one that locates there as you can see and they sit back in you can see where the locating lugs go and you squeeze them back in again after you've taken them out and cleaned them put some copper grease on the back of the one with the pistons and if you squeeze that back in you can then get the uh, one second again there you go that just pops straight back in there again and then you nip them up and you do exactly the same uh, putting it back together how you took it off and don't remember to nip everything up after you've done it okay cheers for watching i hope that helps sorry it's a bit shaky but very hot day in the shed today cheers for watching